द सीक्रेट ऑफ गेटिंग अहेड इज गेटिंग स्टार्टेड मार्क ट्वेन साथियों वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग मैं आपके बीच अपना इंट्रोडक्शन देना चाहता हूं जरा सुनिए अ वेरी गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स माय नेम इज दिनेश कुमार एंड आई एम ग्रेजुएट आई एम फ्रेंड्स दिस इंट्रोडक्शन फिनिश वेन इट स्टार्टेड it did not compete or it did not fulfill the idea or the desire of giving introduction so dear viewers first of all you will have to learn how to speak in english how to prepare your introduction how to be more confident and how to come up with your idea to speak in english In this video, I want to talk about what you can say specifically when you're giving a 60-second self-introduction. So, dear viewers, first of all, if you are interested to learn how to speak in English, this is a good platform where you have signed in just now. We will learn how to speak in English fluently. The body of your speech. If you want to speak in english fluently and confidently what will be the structure the body that makes you speak in english watch english channel watch english videos listen to english conversations talk to people who speak in english and this way a uh, body of english speaking structure will be framed in your body a kind of idea will be generated in you it will be generated self in your mind and your soul second topic is you practice with native speakers do not forget to practice your speaking skill with your native speakers those who can speak in english what am i talking about why am i suggesting to talk to the native speakers because those who are from your village those who are from your area they know you better they know the local language they know how to pronounce words and this way if they know how to speak in english they will be able to convert your thought into action into sentence and your conversation with that person will be successful now next topic is speak in english daily do not forget do not postpone it if you do something every day if you do something in a regular basis it becomes your habit it becomes your part of daily routine so dear viewers i would like to suggest you to speak in english every day do not postpone it do not think that if i make 3 or 4 days absent so other days i will complete it no you will have to prepare yourself speaking every day speak in english speak that language which you want to learn every day learn good vocabulary how to prepare good vocabulary that we have discussed and again i want to remind you read story books and there underline or highlight good words vocabs synonyms antonyms idioms homophones and this way idioms and phrases words and their meanings they flourish your english language they make your english language more better more attractive you become more fluent when you keep on preparing your uh, when you keep on preparing your vocabulary words whenever you are going to speak next topic is speak clearly whatever you speak do not copy others pronunciation do not copy other people 
you speak your own but you speak clearly whatever you are going to speak in your conversation whatever your sentence is do not hesitate please prepare yourself be confident and give a good delivery of your sentence prepare your sentence and give a good delivery of your sentence listen to english music every day english music english songs english poems english conversation english dialogues english movies english theater why am i using these words because they are related to english language and they can frame the structure or the body of spoken english you can improve your english language through these all practicing practicing all this in your life so do not miss it listen to english music watch english movie watch english channel watch english videos and follow how the people pronounce each and every words in your daily life next topic is use english in your daily life how you can change your phenomena how can you change your way of speaking how can you motivate yourself preparing and going on the top of conversation it is only possible when you start preparing english in your daily life suppose you go to some restaurant or some hotel where you want to have dinner or lunch so you order food in english you talk to the people who come to take order like waiter if he comes to take order you talk to him in english basically they pronounce good words they try to speak in english and you can use your english language there only whenever you go to your office there you speak in english with the people with your colleagues and with your partners whenever you are at home you talk to your uh, family members in english whenever you are at your college or your office you talk to your uh, office mates in english language whenever you are traveling in train or by tram or by car or by any uh, bus any convince if you get a chance to talk to people you try to speak in english in conclusion i would like to say if you have desire to speak in english you follow these rules and regulations make yourself more confident stand up move ahead and do not look behind keep preparing yourself do not forget to have good practice and the last point is keep practicing and practicing and practicing because practice makes a man perfect and do not forget to subscribe the channel thank you very much